Today I want to show you how I make flavoured syrup out of edible flowers. First, we need to find a suitable container to bring with us. I'm bringing a 1 litre glass jar, but you can use pretty much anything. Jam jars, ice cream tubs, Ziploc bags, whatever you have in the house. Just keep in mind that it needs to fit the amount you want to pick, and you might want something that can be sealed for practical reasons. I've chosen to pick firewoods today because there are many of them growing close to the road and they're easy to spot. Also, they don't have any double gangers, meaning I can't confuse them with any other flowers. That's something you always want to check before going foraging. You don't want to accidentally make poison, right? Before picking any flower, you want to give them a good and aggressive shake. This is to get rid of any bugs hiding on there. And if you're ever picking fireweed, you want to keep an eye out for bees. Bees love fireweeds. I hope this goes without saying, but let those bees finish their feed before you start shaking. The fun thing about foraging is that when you start looking for one thing, you might discover berries and other fun things too. It's a good idea to bring a couple of smaller containers, just in case you find something else you want to pick. To make the syrup, you need water, sugar and lemon. I ended up picking one liter of flowers, so I need one liter of water. I'll write that all down in the description. Bring the water to a boil and then add the sugar. I added 500 grams. That sounds like a lot, but when you're using syrup, you normally dilute it and I mean, why am I defending the sugar content in syrup? It's syrup. Heat that mixture up again and let the sugar dissolve completely. And now you can add your lemon. If you have access to organic lemon, you should keep the peel on. Unfortunately, I couldn't find any good organic lemons this day, but that's okay. I just peeled it first. And now, finally, you can add the flowers. Just dump them all in there. And don't do this. <laughs> I picked out some of the green leaves, but you could seriously burn yourself on the hot syrup. Leave them in there or use a spoon or something. Now submerge the petals. You can turn the heat off at this point. Then you want to leave that to cool and steep for at least 24 hours before pouring it through a sieve into a sterilized container. And it's done! I don't mind some little seeds or pulp, but if you do, then use a finer sieve or a coffee filter or cloth or something like that. I'm gonna enjoy some straight away with some fizzy water and ice. It should keep for at least a couple of weeks in the fridge, but I recommend freezing it in smaller portions. Super simple and delicious.